Hi, I'm Nettie. Recently I was scrolling the internet and I came across a video of a hyper-realistic cake and someone cutting straight through it. And I kept scrolling and I kept seeing these types of videos, so I thought, okay, this is a trend, how can I milk it for views? And then it hit me. I have to sample the one and only Cake Boss from TLC. So here we are. Today, we are going to make a dubstep drop out of only Cake Boss sounds. Alright, here it is. Alright, so why don't we copy that right over and uh, we'll convert it to an mp3 so we can sample it. Alright, let's drag that right into Ableton. So we have a gigantic audio clip now of 9 minutes long. Alright, so now I'm just gonna scroll through anything that might sound cool in the context of a drop. And I'll be right back with you once that's done. Alright, out of the uh, very few samples that we've actually collected here, we have a few very solid ones. Ow, we've done some huge cakes. I'm gonna go on Splice and find some, like, sword sounds. That sounds like it's like a knife cutting through cake. Let's get a splatter sound. Alright, there we go. So now we have pretty much every single sample that we need. Let's get a kick. Let's get a clap as well. So, let's get started with the main bass patch, I guess. Okay, let's focus on this one real quick and let's turn it way up. Let's EQ out the uh, low end. Let's frequency shift it. Let's add a fat rack. Let's add some tonal delay. And let's just stack the fat rack. Let's add a corpus. Ooh, I like that. Let's make it sub and serum. Let's uh, make this go like this. And then let's frequency shift it on like the second part. To be honest, that sounds way cooler than this. Let's get a um, crash loop. And let's duplicate this and then just remove all this. And then we'll use one of the other sounds. Let's just do something like, like we duplicate it over and over again. And then we'll consolidate that. Let's just raise it up a little bit, like two octaves. Let's see what happens when we tune the effects back on. Ooh, um, it's the uh, deep fry rack. So what this deep fry rack does is I just have like a crap ton of effects on it that you should not put in, in a normal order, but I'm doing it anyway. It essentially does that, like it just deep fries the shit out of it. Let's just like make the uh, artifact like the main base. So let's just freeze this and flatten it. Okay, and now we have this. So let's like pitch this up the second time. Let's make this, uh, this artifact thing like a little bit cooler. Let's OTT it. Let's frequency shift to this maybe. Um, let's do something about this because it's a little bit boring. Let's add a flanger. Just need to like frequency shift down over time. Alright, let me move all this over. Oh yeah, so we still have the sword and cake sounds. I mean the drums sound cool, but I don't know if they work for this song. Let's like pitch it down then. Oh, we haven't actually used this thing. Let's use this as like an offbeat thing. First off, what key is that in? Okay, I think that's an A. Let's get the uh... We've done some huge cakes. We've done some huge cakes. We've done some huge cakes. Let's uh, see if we can like take this thing and then like... Yo, that's so sick. Let's get a uh, fill. <laughs> this could do with like a um, like a little zap. We're gonna have to make a uh, zap out of this. Ow. Let's get an EQ. Freeze this, flatten it. Let's see if we can like stretch it out. So I'm gonna pitch it way down, then warp it, and then uh, pitch it back up. And then you have a super long thing. And then let's freeze it again and flatten it again. Freeze that again, flatten it again, and then let's pitch it up again. There we go, now we have a little zap. Oh, beautiful. I think I want like a little crash. Okay, let's take this and then like switch up the flow of it a little bit. Let's do that. Let's 
So I'll take this and then we'll pitch it up an octave. All right, so I think we're done with this. Why don't we go ahead and show the cakiness of it? A dubstep drop made out of cake boss sounds. Let me know if you liked it. Leave a comment down below. Like and subscribe. Goodbye. Ah, there we go. Another successful recording done. Wait, it wouldn't happen that that's cake too, right?